And here we have a superstar with a big chip on his shoulder. He has certainly felt overlooked recently. Well, he has a chance to change that perception in this matchup. And with all that said, we cannot undersell Braun Breaker in this one, guys. This is a superstar who always pushes himself to a whole new limit. So we should be in for something special here. Yeah, I suppose there is something special about dogged intensity, Saxton. Not that you'd know anything about being intense or special. Set up in the corner of the ring. Vicious shoulder tackle in the corner. How humiliating. Oh. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyperextend your elbow. For another back and forth we go. Oh, my Buster! Corey, at the risk of sounding indelicate, how do you deal with a genetic freak like Braun Breaker? He is indeed a genetic freak. But Braun Breaker is also very young. Braun's natural talent is insane, but his inexperience is a major weakness you can target. If you could somehow survive his offensive onslaught, he'll likely make a mistake you can capitalize on. Just deadlifting their opponent, tossing their power. The oh. No, he pops the shoulder before three. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Uh oh. Oh God, that, that, that's a bad landing. A totally ill-advised decision there. Maybe slight hesitation there caused the outcome. Russian leg sweep. Continuing to work on the arm with a vicious knee drop. And that intensity of Braun's going to taper down a bit there. Just cranking the head. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Uh-oh. slides him back to the mat. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the ref's count, Cole. Oh, Ooh. knee lift. Somebody better check his nose. Has them hooked. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. Setting foot in the ring now. He turns it around. In plan for this. DDT! This match is brutality starting to show on him. There's been plenty of action in this match, and the cost of that is really showing now. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Sends him into the corner. In the middle rope. From the middle rope into a bulldog. Big elbow. Uh-oh. Well scattered reversal there. Oh, and Breaker turns the tables. Breaker. 
full focus from Braun. Braun Breaker setting him up for the military oh, the military press into the power slam. Will Breaker finish things now? Cover! No, he beats the cover. I don't know how he just kicked out, and I'll tell you what, I don't really think he knows either. And Breaker has to be wondering just what it's going to take to end this. How far does he have to go? Watch out! Somersault plancha to the floor. That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. An imposing array of offense from him here. His offense is second to none at times like this. Into the barricade. And he had Braun's number there. A face buster knee smash. That looks painful. Down to opponent and a double axe handle smash. Back into the ring. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Kick to the gut. Break the line into a neck breaker. And that attack has to weaken Breaker even more. Breaker's in danger now. Smart counter to that maneuver. Incoming. Cross landing. Powerball. There you go, Cole. Set up. Spear by Brian Breaker. Breaker taking things to another level. I didn't think his intensity could go any higher, but I was just proven wrong. Ron Breaker, his strength on display. This is absolutely incredible. Boom! Military press power slam. Breaker might have it. There's two! It's over. Ron Breaker gets it done. Here's your winner. Ron Breaker! I'm still in shock. This was definitely a grueling match for all competitors. No one was willing to give even a single inch of ground in this battle. At times, it seemed like these competitors were totally deadlocked, but here you see the one who prevailed. Always need to be on your toes whenever you face off against multiple combatants. That is especially true in this triple threat with Carmelo Hayes, Cameron Grimes, and Grayson Waller. The significance of this match being no countouts or disqualifications can't be understated. Not only do you have to worry about a second opponent, but you gotta worry about your adversaries fighting dirty and it being perfectly legal. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. He has a kendo stick in hand, and this place just turned into South Swanson Street. And that one misses the mark. Kendo stick to the skull. Catapulting down on the opponent. And set right into the corner. Got them right in the corner. And I feel like you really have to keep your head on a swivel in this match. That's an understated way of putting it, Cole, but the good news is if you've made it this far, you're doing something right. He goes for the quick pin attempt. He stops the count. Power oh, shot. Pulls the ripcord. Knee strike to the face. Oh, kick right in the face. The sheer confidence of Carmelo Hayes taking over. And that DDT was well delivered. He's getting a little battered now. Double the opponents means double the danger. He better have a plan. And Grimes capitalizes there. He turns it around. The DDT. Wow. Look at the height on the leaping stump. Say it, guys. That looked like it 
hurt a lot. That gets reversed on Grimes. Weapon in hand saying, I'm up in the ante. No stick impact. Saw that one coming. Counter by Grayson. Oh, this is going to be nasty. Driven down. Focusing on a body part, picking it apart. The arm's as good of a place to focus as any. It's ruthless striking. Now he's been put on the defensive. Another oh, rearranger skull. This is right for him. Keeping a loss at bay for now. There he goes, right into the corner. He switches it back around. A snap there. And he barely hit And Grayson gets that turn back on him. Tough position to be caught in here. See, but it sure looks effective from here. Letting everyone know he's got full intent on using that kendo stick. Waller knew that was coming. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. Bang it back with their own counter. DDT! Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. Something that can further crumble Grayson. 
No doubt about it, it is do or die for Waller at this point. He'll head to the ring. Oh, across the top rope. Still, this could be it. Oh, package drive. And imagine if his own move leads to his downfall. This man can withstand anything. Just survived the pain torn from his own playbook. That was the home run shot that got robbed at the fence. Listen to this place. It's unreal. The decibel level in here right now is breaking glass. These fans are on fire. Can't believe it. Big impact. And Grayson continues to push through. Yeah, Grayson no less dangerous here as his opponent is quickly finding out. Oh, impact to the stomach. Bell right to the kidneys. Golly. Oh, counters right into the bread basket. You can see Carmelo's eyes tracking the enemy knight. Carmelo Hayes. Going to turn a series. And went down in a heap. He breaks up the pin, and Corey, the match continues. I love it. DDT. <laughs> Trap the arm. sends a message. Send two superstars. Send three. Send four. Heck, send a whole army. It's only going to be an uphill battle for the competition. A very dynamic kind of match here in this triple threat. Incredible about how just adding one competitor to a match can change a superstar's entire form of fighting. It totally alters their balance. Go from one opponent to two. You have to attack twice as hard and play defense twice as much. Hurricanrana. Ooh, what a forearm club. 
And this might not have a pleasant ending. You ever see a human being tossed like that? That move had the amount of force akin to a natural disaster. Are you 
you sure? Are you sure that's two? We are beginning to reach a point of desperation in this match. These athletes' bodies can only take them so far. You have to imagine they're reaching their breaking point. Ooh, a lip. DDT. Tiffany's on Dream Street. She's still alive. She was barely able to get that shoulder up. I cannot believe she had the wherewithal. There's got to be some sense of desperation right now. She's used her best weapon, but the match still continues. Makes the cover. Triple threat. Here is your winner, Aaliyah! As exciting a triple threat match as we've had here in WWE in recent memory. There's a reason this is called a triple threat match, gentlemen, and these three superstars just showed us all why. Now Cora Jade, guys, has proven herself to be quite the talented young superstar in such a short time, but she's really been showing an unexpected callousness in and out of the ring. Cora Jade demands to be taken seriously, and she's let her actions in the ring do the talking, Michael, no matter what the collateral damage. Yeah, she's certainly developed much more of a ruthless streak when it comes to competing. Just look in her eyes right now. She'll be facing Roxanne Perez, who really took that long way to WWE and honed her teeth on the independent scene. That is not a path that teaches you how to quit easily. Really separates the ones who want it from the ones who don't. Make no mistake, Perez wants it. Thanks. Inverted face lock into an elbow drop. Referee in position, and she kicks out. She's trying to drain some energy with that early cover. Able to get out of the way. Running her Conrada. It's incredible the inventiveness we are seeing on display here. Counter. And now there's an opening. Oh, call it a power bomb. A power bomb like that will leave you with bruises and remind you of this moment for days. And it's been a heck of a journey for Perez thus far. What does she have to do in order to keep it going with a victory in this match? Roxanne is new to WWE, but she's by no means a rookie in this business. She has well-earned instincts that got her to the dance, and she needs to trust them and remember that whatever happens, she's probably been there before. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Looking for a schoolboy. Uh-oh. Perez had a bit of the fight taken out of her there. Yes, yeah, Cora proving she does not care one bit about her opponent's feelings or well-being. What great agility. Acrobatics like that take a tremendous amount of cardio and strength. Uh-oh, this is just vicious. Nasty stomp of the arm. And Roxanne had it scouted. There's press. And did you hear the impact of that? Got to find a way back into the ring now. Before the count runs out. And able to beat Perez to the punch. Into an elbow drop. Just got back in. She manages to get control. Ooh, she hit the corner hard. They went right to the face. Is it enough here? No, a kick out. Easy kick out there, but they'll get harder soon. Ooh, and a reversal. Ooh, what a damaging blow. Ooh, what a full club. She's beginning to flag a little. Oh, Jade with good timing on the reversal. Sure, European uppercut. Wow. 
Nice hip toss takedown. Whoa, that was nice. And Jade's cut with a reversal. Grab in the arm. STO! Spiked! And there, shoulders down. This could be the one that does it for him. Breaks the count. This is going to come down to who wants it more. Roxanne Perez. Roxanne can taste victory now. Shoulders down. One, two. Wow, just barely making it out. Just when you think it's the end, she stays alive. What amazing resilience. Is this the start of a comeback? The heaviest artillery has been used, but it's not enough for the three. Tossing your own body around without a care. Taking no account for their own well-being. Right to the leg. Corey can't find a foothold in this match. Roxanne putting that in-ring instinct to good use. Trusting in what she's learned from past experiences. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Right to the back of the neck. She adjusts it and reverses it. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. And here we go now. Elbow drop to the knee. She can't take much more of this. She is barely standing at this point. Oh. Roxanne now has a leg up in this match. Corn's getting knocked back at every turn. Wasn't three. God damn. The superstar goes. Momentum being built. Tremendous resilience. You can feel the growing confidence. is huge. I'm sure they'll be posting about this on social media all week long. What are you expecting from this superstar tonight, guys? Well, he did say earlier that he's going to attack his opponent with a renewed hostility that we've never seen before. Yeah, he also said he's going to make the competition beg for mercy. And Joe Gacy is clearly looking for a sacrifice here tonight. He once offered the locker room a chance at inclusivity, a chance of belonging. But once he realized just how little his fellow superstars appreciated him and what he was offering, he vowed to instead be divisive. Whether you like it or not, Gacy has been extremely successful in that endeavor. Joe capitalizes on that misstep. Caught with a clothesline. Something here. Down on the windpipe. Look at the catch him off guard. He kicks out before two. Not even a two count for him. Incoming. Taking this to the floor. Oh, did you hear that thud? You have to question what kind of malintent is behind a power bomb with that much force. Oh, God. 
You know, for as much as Gacy likes to talk about how nothing even matters, I've noticed that he's not exactly unflappable in the ring. If you push the right buttons when you're facing off against him, you can absolutely frustrate him. Uh, nobody asked about your observations, Cole. Gacy is unflappable. I have no idea what you're talking about. In control here with a swinging neckbreaker. Textbook. The device of Gacy getting a taste of how the locker room really feels about him in there. No need to panic. He's still swinging. Boom. <laughs> he may not be aware of the count. He's got to get back in. No, they beat the count. Just barely. Into the corner. This can't be good. He thinks he has it. Only a one count before the kick out. I didn't think this match was close to over. Kick to the gut. Another damaging Bang. kick. Slide. Nice combo. Show is now under heavy pressure. And I guess that maybe Joe Gacy isn't unflappable. He's really gotten frustrated at this point and doesn't seem to be finding a way out of it. Sky high. Oh, man. He's struggling a bit here. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Oh, uh, setting him up for the shit breaker. Oh, my goodness. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. Joe is not taking this lying down anymore. Joe could be turning his fortunes into a headbutt. Leg drop. What reflexes to stop Gacy? Casey proving just what he means when he calls himself. Look at their opponent from behind, driven down and locking it in. Rings of Saturn. After everything these two men have been through, will it end like this? Will it end with a submission tap out? His body might. Whoa, whoa look at that. And somehow he's able to work his way out of the hole. to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh, the knee takes a big hit. He's looking shaky at best now. Yeah, not looking good at all.
Now oh, trampling the opposition. Draped across the top rope. Plumbing four. Carefully measured knee drop. So precise. Gacy has lost any sense of command in this one. Yeah, somehow Gacy has got to turn the tide. Oh, Ooh, twist to the arm. This cuts into the elbow. Oh, my God. Pendulum backbreaker. Tick tock. As the opponent right where they want. Just dished out his most devastating up. Oh, uh, look out. He misses the target. Short flight, but a rough landing. You can see it in these superstars' faces. They're in serious pain at the moment. Well, a lot of punishment has been dished out, but no one is thinking about quitting. And that's some late match offense from Joe. Yes, he's been scratching and clawing to force the momentum back in his face. Taking flight. The official sees it and waves off the pen. He's looking completely lost as he finds his footing. He's turning the tables. Right to the kidneys from behind. Kick right to the midsection into a... Oh, hand of slam. Establishes him to the world. An important win for him in this one. After this win, you cannot question the heart and determination of this superstar. Well said, Byron. I don't think anyone will be questioning that from now on. And as this match gets started, we're looking at an unflinching superstar ready to throw down. True words spoken. She's been itching to get this fight started for quite some time now, but it'll be interesting to see if she's bitten off more than she can chew. I believe she's coming to this match with the exact attitude needed for the challenge. And she'll be facing off against the always opportunistic Carmella. And that is a backhanded way of saying that Carmella has one of the best in-ring IQs in the business. Come on, Saxton, I thought you were better than that. Wait, actually, no, I didn't. Set up for the side rush and leg sweep. Rounding a downed opponent, look at them go over and over and over again. And a slap, too. Hold on a second, could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. Uh, submission locked in, no we're going to find an escape from the abdominal stretch. Uh-oh, found it. Oh! Corey, I'm not telling you anything you don't know by saying that Carmella has a tendency to run her mouth. Do you think that could possibly be a detriment here? Now, Cole, I would never suggest that Carmella should talk less. But I will say Carmella's trash talking possibly allows her competition the perfect opportunity to counterattack. All her opponent needs is one opening to capitalize on, and she could negate all of Carmella's blast off. Splash! Is it enough? Stops the ref count before two. It's not over yet. Plenty left to go in this one. Evading offense. Uh, 
Oh, what a hip toss. Great athleticism and a drop kick to finish. Boom, slam. With authority. Ah, look at this. Hard breaker. Pamela might need to start leaning on her in-ring IQ after an attack like that. And all the impact brought to the knee. Kidneys. Golly. Kick to the gut. The setup. Up and. And turns it around for Carmella. Oh, and she turns it around. Sit out slam. Oh, that's going to sting your back. And Mella now finding herself on the wrong side of moment. Taking flight. Diving body splash. Two fists full of hair. This can't be legal. Uh -oh. Win at any cost. Kick to the gut. The setup. Up and. match all around and here is our winner it's always great to visit the pay window but a victory like this makes the winner's purse all that much sweeter